The Waukesha County man charged in a pursuit and lengthy standoff that shut down I-94 near Oconomowoc in court today for sentencing. Christina Van Zels has Nathan Halfman's apology and the judge's response to it. I would say that I am here to accept responsibility for my actions and say that I am sorry to anyone affected by those actions. Um, I truly do regret them. Nathan Halfman apologizing in court Thursday. Police say the 38-year-old and his alleged accomplice, Kaylin Sundy, led law enforcement on a chase last June. Sundy negotiating with police on Facebook Live as the five-hour-long standoff in the village of Summit shut down I-94 near Highway 67. There's not a second of any day that has gone by since this has happened that I am not reminded of it both physically and mentally. Prosecutors say Halfman was armed at the time and was shot by officers after running away. He entered a guilty plea and was sentenced to eight years in prison. Something about those drugs, though, um, brought out an inner demon in you, and that inner demon in 2019 became very violent. The person that was on that overpass that night was my son, and he was a heroin addict. And that addiction... Um, led him down a path that spiraled towards desolation. And as Halfman learns his sentence, he's hopeful for his future with plans to better himself. And I'm fully committed to getting back to the person that I was. Christina Van Zelst, Fox 6 News.